Bloody Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's Manga Nerdigan Live reaction video is going to be for Dr. Stone chapter 45. And last chapter we got an idea of how the village uh, began, like after uh, Senku's dad landed on Earth with the rest of the people in the space station. And, um, and we also saw what happened when Senku turned to stone. Like we already knew that he was counting in his head and shit like that. But um, we got to actually see how it started, which I thought was pretty sweet. Anyway, let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. Through lives linked. Oh my god, I love this cover. It's so pretty. Look how pretty it is. It's Sekka reaching out for Papa's hand. Oh my god. But like something that I was thinking about too was how much inbreeding has happened. Um... This whole thing sounds so weird. squeak has got no idea what the he what the heck is going on at all. They're talking about thousands of years ago. All of mankind was turned to stone. You've seen all those statues laying all over the place, right? Those are all humans. A distant memory. Thanks to the fact that they were in space, Senku's father and his five comrades were saved. And every last one of us here in Ishigami Village are, de are their descendants across these thousands of years. Yeah. So does that mean all of us are Senku's relatives? <laughs> Yakuya and I aren't related by uh, by blood, so it's just by family name. Anyways, it's been freaking centuries. Relatives don't mean crap by now. <laughs> Dude, why did Kohaku ask that? I wonder! I'm telling you, Kohaku's gonna hook up with Senku by the end of the series. Hey, what are you doing? You're the guest of honor. Uh, you're the guest of honor. We're having a party down here. Um, the birth of a new village chief. You guys just want to get. You guys just want to get drunk. Um, shall we uh, go to the party uh, all together? Chief. At the very end of the stories is a message from your father. I thought it would be right to tell it to you privately. I figured it was something like that. No, Seku's not gonna get it on with um Rory. She's not. He's not. He's being good. If we make it back to the mainland, we can get um antibiotics. This time it's our turn to risk our lives on it all. If by chance uh, we don't return, take care of the children. To pneumonia. God damn it. To something like pneumonia. Everyone, um, everyone's looking surprisingly serious and somber. You too, old man. You said it yourself, didn't you? With the world in the state, we could use some fun. Yeah, that's right. Even without the daily joys of life, um, humans wouldn't die. It was fun. No! humanity made it to space we alone were saved hindsight really is amazing i never once thought of having a wife and children before but now i have them <laughs> it's truly been fun ever since the day we went together into space oh man there's one thing that i've always wanted to say to you ever since that uh, day right when humanity was turned to stone when you forced me to eat that ramen that, that ramen that I ate in space. It's you. I couldn't even help but smile. Oh. Hold on a second. Let me just double check. Uh. Oh. Yeah, one day humanity will make it back there to a point where they'll be able to um, eat ramen in space again for sure. You're writing a story, um, like a time capsule containing, uh, uh, like, all our wisdom, um, all our wisdom so that our descendants can survive, but I've got to make sure the story is interesting, as expected of a former teacher. But it's tough writing a story in English. Um, then just write, write it in Japanese. After all, I'd love to learn your home country's language. The 100 stories. The most important things will be information about food and avoiding danger, like fierce animals. <laughs> oh my god. I definitely want a story about ore and minerals. I hope that perhaps someday someone might appear with um, an interest in rocks going, going around and collecting them all. <laughs> yes! You got me, 
Jackie, uh, you called it. The first of, 100, of uh, the 100 stories will be based on creating a, ja a Japan to await Senku's return someday. The final of the 100 stories will be a message from me. <laughs> oh my god, Yaki, you are just... Oh, if you're listening to this story, Senku, then that means it may be thousands of years later, but you've broken out of your petrification, right? I'm doing great. Well, actually, I'm probably dead by now. I'll make sure to bring you home a whole boatload of scientific, scientific souvenirs. Just as I promised, my scientific souvenirs are the comrades that have been connected by the 100 stories. <laughs> um, though the world as we know it has co um, has collapsed, it's been pretty fun. Even if in the uh, the end I was done uh, for by something as lame as pneumonia. <laughs> Seku, if you can find allies to combine with your science, I'm sure you'll create a world that's even greater. <laughs> I know you won't lose. Rebuild uh, civilization up from z uh, from zero, and save all of humanity. Senku, if anyone could do it, it's you. This is the village uh, village's graveyard. The small um, grave mar uh, marker is where the remains of the founders have been brought, or so um, has been told. Cuckoo, they died over 3,700 years ago. If I'm being real for a minute, there's not even fragments of bones left of them by now. I'll be back in a little bit. I've got something I want to check out. Okay, I'll head back to the village first. I see. So, you've already been gone for thousands of years. While I was alone in the darkness, still counting away at the billions of seconds. Cuckoo, it, so it seems so nostalgic now. Yeah, it really does seem so nostalgic. Senku, if anyone can do it, it's you. Oh my god, is Senku gonna cry? Yes, he just cried! Senku! Kukuku, without your scientific souvenirs, I'd have been in a seriously rough spot. Um, though it's thousands of years later, thank you for the gift. Oh, Senku! No thanks, I'm a cola aficionado. Cola? <laughs> My boy! <laughs> if I drink that, I won't be able to talk straight anymore. And now that the village situation is finally under control, I need to tell him. Yeah, let me hear what you gotta say, mentalist. What happened uh, in the Sukasa Empire? <gasps> They're coming! Sukasa is big! <gasps> Chapter 2, Stone Wars. Kukuku, at last, it's time to show off the power of the kingdom of science. Now this excites me. <gasps> We're going to get to the Stone Wars. We're getting to the Stone Wars. Oh my god, I am so fucking excited. We are getting to the Stone Wars. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so let me give you my thoughts about this arc because we're gonna now we're going to go into like probably the fucking most epic arc of this series, which is going to be the Stone Wars, which we've all been waiting for. Um, this arc was fantastic. Uh, the Like, especially since the village was left to Senku by Byakuya. Like, that is just amazing that he thought ahead that much. And to, and, um, and so we don't know about Senku's real parents. It's driving me nuts. But this, this, oh my god. This arc has been really, really, really fun. Like, I actually really enjoy the majority of the characters now. And not just Senku. We got the bro, we got the bro squad going on. And, um, oh, wait till Sukasa finds out that he's been double, that he's been double crossed. Oh man, it's gonna be amazing. Um, I'm very curious what you guys thought of this arc. Are you guys like, who were excited for the Star Wars? I'm so excited for the Star Wars. It's gonna like I'm a Senku. This excites me too. So now, what Senku and Chrome are gonna do? What the Bros are gonna do? Is they're gonna make some weapons. Oh man, Sukasa, you have no chance against weapons, especially if uh, we got get like Gatling guns and cannons and shit. Oh, ho, ho, ho. 
Oh man, that'd be awesome. Anyway, I'm very curious what you guys thought of what you guys saw this arc. What are you guys looking forward to in the Stone Wars arc? Because it's gonna be it's gonna be brain versus brawn. That's just what it really is going is gonna come to. Um, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdikins Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to contribute to my channel expansion, there's a few ways you can do that. You can donate to my PayPal, Patreon, uh, GoFundMe, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, um, Facebook, and PlayStation Network. All that's in the description box below as well. Until next time, Nerdikins, I'll be seeing you later.